Hello everybody and welcome to the coffee table. Can you believe we're already a week into November? November this month is about thankfulness. And I want to start by saying thank you to everyone who had a hand in making this weekend's Maker's Market a wonderful success. First of all, we have to say thank you to the Council of Catholic Women, whose leadership and hard work brought this event from a really good idea to a really great reality. They put in countless hours planning, crafting, publicizing, organizing, baking, and a million things I'm not even aware of. You ladies are a tremendous gift to our community. I also want to thank our staff. They are amazing for everything that they did, which was a lot to make the market a success. Everybody pitched in, but I specifically want to thank Kimberly and Richard for their dedication and very hard work. And of course, thank you to each and every one of you who came out and enjoyed the day with us. It was just a little chilly in that dunk tank. This week is Vocations Awareness Week. Please join me in praying for vocations, perhaps praying the luminous mysteries of the rosary, which St. John Paul II said were particularly helpful for those discerning a vocation. The diocese has created the Project Rachel Helpline. If you or someone you know has been impacted by an abortion, confidential, non-judgmental help is available through the Diocese of Orlando Project Rachel dedicated helpline. You can call or text 407 222-8584 or email projectrachel at cflcc.org. This Thursday we celebrate Veterans Day. On that day we will remember and pray in a special way for all American veterans, living or dead, who served their country honorably during war or peacetime. Join us for Mass that morning if you are able. Attention youth group parents, please come to an information meeting on Sunday, November 14th at 6.30 p.m. We love our parents and we want you to be involved and informed. We'll meet in the adult ministry building while your teens are meeting in the youth building. Please mark your calendars. Please be on the lookout for the next bulletin for lots of information about this year's angel tree. The trees will be up throughout Advent and we look forward to working with our community to bring joy to as many people as possible this Christmas. More information about everything I've been talking about can be found in the bulletin, so please check that out, our website, our Facebook page for updates and more parish news. Please pray for me this week and I will pray for you and I will see you at Mass.